Good afternoon from Colchester, Orchard Percussion Afternoon Clinic today and it's the 12th of June. The 7th Clinic. 7th Clinic, one more to go. Yeah. Oh, you're going to miss me. No. <laughs> and today's question is going to come from Bezerk. How did Gavin first get into playing the drums at such a young age? Was, he, was, he, was it playing along with his father? And who was or were his first inspirations in the drumming world? Yeah, I mean, my dad was a, a trumpet player, and me and my brothers all tried to play the trumpet. I was actually the worst one, it was really hard to play. And my dad could play a little bit of drums, so he'd put on his jazz records, get out a magazine and play the brushes like on, on, the, um, on the magazine, and that was good fun. And then a friend of his from the talk of the town, uh, Bobby Worth, gave him a cymbal, so we made a little cymbal stand and we'd play, just like ride along to it. There was a nice drummer called Freddie Adamson, who was a friend of my dad's, he'd come round and sort of show me things. And then of course Paul Brody, the drummer of the BBC radio band, who I'm still in touch with today. And I used to go to the radio orchestra, the radio BBC big band and sit next to Paul, you know, and I, it was incredibly inspiring. He was amazing. He'd have me on his kit, just sort of sit and play around on his kit in these coffee breaks and it, it was just a dream come true. Sitting in the middle of a big band, age eight, you know, I mean, it's just fantastic, exciting. So, you know, uh, before I had lessons with Joe Hodson, I was, it was mainly encouraged from my dad's friends like Bobby Worth, Freddie Adamson, Paul Brody. Okay, good. Great. Okay, keep the questions coming. We've got one more day tomorrow, and then that's it. Thank you very much.